Hello guys, welcome to another video in the series of tutorial on Angular material with Angular. In the previous video, we have seen different types of buttons of Angular material and how to disable the click functionality of the button. There is another similar real-time scenario where you want to disable only the ripple effect but you want to retain or enable the click functionality of a button. As you can see in the browser, this is an example which we have created in the previous video where you can see there is no click functionality as we have disabled this button. So let's see how to achieve that one in Angular material. Let me open code editor where we have already written code for a raised button which is already disabled. As we don't want to disable this one, let me remove this one, save the file and go back to browser. You can observe now it is clickable and have ripple effect as well. Go back to code editor. As we want to remove only the ripple effect of this button, there is another property of angular material that is disable ripple. Add that one in the open tag of button. That is the only thing which you need to do to remove the ripple effect of the button. Let's save this file and go back to browser. Now click on the button. You can observe button is clickable but when you click on the button there is no animation or ripple effect. That is another nice feature which will be useful in some of the scenarios. That's it guys for this short video. Thanks for watching this. If you like this video please click on like button, share it with others and subscribe to my channel.